manufacturing and construction, basic and advanced, the classes are mixed. My advanced students have been tasked with coming up with a project that they want to make, something of their own either design, which um, Jared's working on, or something plans that they've, plans that they've found, um, like Devin's working on the poker table. That's mm -hmm. actually an Ask This Old House project. All of us learn because I've never made a poker table before, so Devin's coming to me and we're having to kind of come up against some obstacles and say, okay, how are we going to modify this? How are we going to fix this? Or my basic students have seven projects that they're currently working on. I let them do things to just kind of learn how the machines work. I'm not as concerned quite about the fit and finish of my basic students' projects, more that they understand how angles work, more that they understand what machines cut what, how they work, how they operate, where the safety features are, and kind of get them used to using the machines get up into the advanced class, now I want to see what did you learn in the basic class and how did you bring that to the advanced class. So this is the bottom of my poker table and I had to, we're going to glue or screw all these to the bottom of it and then we're going to put some decorative trim around here and then we're going to build a whole top to it. It's going to have a cup holders and chip holders and all that. Because I wanted something big and I was looking online, looking online for all the different plans I could do and this was the coolest thing. And I was like, well, I didn't know if Mr. World was going to let me do it at first, but he was like, yeah, it sounds like a great idea. And he's very, you know, really impressed and he's going to be a great project. There's pocket holes in here okay. so that it goes up into this. Okay. I think it's, I think it's a different thing than, than their Xbox. It's, they can do things, they see results. Where are you going? That's over here. So get to work with each other, which I think is fundamentally important in, in children because when I was a kid, after school, we all went out and played football in the yard. They all go home and play Xbox. So they now understand how to help each other, how to work together. Hey, I did that project. Let me help you because I made a mistake and I can help you fix that before it gets to that point. Don't worry too awfully much about that. That'll come off on the surface. It's a lot of fun. You get to work with your hands, especially during the school day. You get to break from doing all the homework and the classwork, and just get to take a break and you know, work with your hands a little bit, and it's a lot of fun. They need to have fundamental skills, and they can get a job in the manufacturing or the trades. That industry has between three and five million jobs that are currently going unfulfilled because there are people that don't know that they're there, they're not being educated properly to take them.